welcome back once again now we are going to continue with the tutorial this time we are going to look at how to get the training materials okay so to do that um we are on the home page or let's say landing page okay so what you need to do is right now just come to go to come to your profile here go to profile click on that see we have profile that click on that now go down here you see shop click on the shop okay so after that just go down here you see a product okay and then it's it's under it's still under processing let me see okay so now we have it here uh we can decide to go ahead and download okay let me click on that okay so you see okay so I, good so you can just go ahead and click on download i already already have it so i don't want to download it okay so just go ahead and download it for free okay so um let's go back here i will this i will then let me click here let me go back good so now we have the training material we are going to continue let me close this okay good so this time we are going to design the home page here okay good first of all let's look at how to design this menu okay first um okay so now here this is our front end and this is our back end okay so now let us proceed so what i'm going to do is first of all i'm going to design the header here okay good so let me click here let's go to the front end and over here i will click customize let me click on that okay so um let's go down here okay so let's go down we have header let me see lay page layout so over here container here 10 okay so this one i will make it 11 20 okay i want to make it 11 20 good make sure you do the same let's go back here so we have the top top one i'm talking about okay i don't have that here okay so i will then okay so i can decide to close that now let's go down here and we have normal header okay good so we are going to add color to the normal header as you can see here is white i want to have it as black so there is a black color let me copy that and put it here it's zero 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 okay so just come back here click here then here you see we have hash f f f delete the all the f and leave the hash and enter zero 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 three zero is okay so you see it has changed to black okay so now let's go back and now the next is for us to change the menu okay so let's see right now uh we have i can refresh here and we have this color okay i want this one to be white let's go down here so let's go to menu again the same normal menu and this time icon color let's see the icon color here is black this one is white so the icon color here i can make it uh, white so what i'm going to do is i'm going to drag this here and i will just go to this end okay or you can decide to enter hash f f f f f f okay see it's already white so make sure you enter white white and now when i come here and refresh the page you see the icons are now white but you see when you put a mouse on this one it changed it changes to what yellow okay good so let's do it in that way so i will come here so first let me copy the yellow color and then so i'll come here and i will click here the eye the eye the, the that is the color picker so 
I'll just come here and pick the color. So I have C. Okay, good. So let me give you this how to get this uh, color picker. Just go here and enter color. Sorry, color. Okay, so okay, wrong color picker chrome extension. Just enter something like chrome extension, and here you can just go here to select that. So we have color zero color picker. Okay, so this one is color color pick. Okay. Uh, I drop let's use this one color zero okay I think that's what I'm using right now you see uh, okay so it shows that it has been added already this one and that's the color zero okay so just go ahead and download this color zero from chrome extension or chrome store let me click that so after downloading it uh, it will be added to this part or you will you see it here so if you want to appear here just come here if i want this one to appear here i'll click here and it will appear like that if i want to remove it i can just click that and remove that okay so we are done now let's move on okay so let's come back here i want that to be yellow and i think i've already downloaded uh, copied the yellow color so i will just paste that and the yellow color is what has c28714 or you can just open this site and copy from here okay so that's my yellow color i can just publish that and now when i come here and refresh the page i'll be able to uh, change that you see it's now yellow okay so let's look at this one this one too is white let's change that let's come back here okay so we have color count okay uh, count color okay so this one you want to uh, the count color let's make it white too so this one is going to be white okay so first uh, let me open this here then i will then drag this one or you can enter f f f f okay and that's it okay so let me click here and press that okay so let's see okay this one is what okay is the count that is uh, this one so and it has a background you see the count color the count background okay and here you can see that the count background is red it's um, something like red this red and then so i can decide to copy the red from here or i can copy from here this goes okay so i can copy from that come back here and click here and now i can just paste that here okay it has been added i can post click that okay so okay good you see it's now red now let's look at the menu so let's go down here or oh, let me maintain that let me click here and see okay so the rest is okay so uh, hide count uh cut count with zero no so uh let's go back here and we are here to header transparent we don't want that page header we don't want that no i don't want any page header okay so let's go down here let's see okay good you see i was having problem i'm going to show you how to change this okay this one came this color there's no way we can change it but i'll show you how to change that okay good uh so far so good we have changed this one now let's add our logo okay good so the uh the, the what do you call it? the materials you just downloaded from a reader community uh so it contains the logo and everything okay so I have it here what you need to do is right click and extract it you get a file like this so inside let me see where i can get a logo okay so this is my logo okay so i will then come here go to uh, let's see so i can just go to site identity and then we have logo select so like that i can just click here go inside this one and that is this one 
okay so I have the logo here i can select it upload okay so you see there's a space here here i want to uh, remove that so i'll go to edit image okay so then i will click crop and drag it down here then i will drag this one up okay so let me close this one okay so after that i can just click apply and click save here okay so i can now update okay good so i can just close that then i will then close this one again i can even refresh the page here okay good so i will go here again logo then i will select that you see it's now small click that to insert i want to put it here okay let me go up again and go down and then i can down i can crop it okay then publish that you see it has been added but it's too big let me come here and you see it's too big so let's go down here logo width we can just reduce the logo width you see so that is one two two come here and publish that and you see we have that it's looking amazing is it not good so let's see i think let me click here and click here again this time let me edit again okay i want to close the gap here so crop here this one i just want to close it okay apply save come back here insert so i can just drag this one here open it then open this one go up again okay so i can just come back here let me close this and crop the image okay so i can then publish that and now we are good to go i can go to the back end and we have this I love with this okay so i'm going to show you how to change this one uh the image here okay good okay so this is what we are going to do um i will include that in our next video in our next video i will look at i'll show you how to change this one okay so thank you for watching bye bye